Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Breeze coming back to you today with our first NBA 2K15 defensive tip of the year. Now, as you all know, the 131 has been removed from the game, which balances out a lot, but the good thing is, is I haven't really been running 131 too much in the past couple of years. I've actually been switching up a lot between the 131, 23, and 32. So I have a lot of experience with the 32, and um, it's actually been one of my favorite zones for a while. So really guys, all you want to do is you want to make sure that you're very active on defense. I went over these things last year, but basically my defense is always a high risk, high reward type of defense. We're basically going to be playing with the power forward or center most of the time. Um, we're going to be closing out, of course, with our small forward shooting guard or point guard when they have an open shot. Um, but mainly we're going to be roaming around with our center and our power forward, running around, um, making sure that we're playing the open man, playing the passing lanes, looking to tip down passes, and really just, you know, guessing where they're going to go next, just so that way we can kind of read them like a book, so to speak, you know, guess what they're doing, and then make them pay. Um, now, it's not all about the turnovers, guys. What it's really about is making sure you convert on the fast break, and really making sure that you play a full 24 seconds of defense every time down. This means that, you know, don't always... You know, try to go for the home run. Just play good defense, force contact layups, force bad shots, make them think that they're open when they're not. Because a lot of times, you guys may say, oh, well, this guy was open, or that guy was open. Well, yeah, but I have my eyes on everyone who's open. You know, if they, you can pass to someone who looks open, it doesn't mean they're actually open. Because as you can see right here, you know, I'm going to close that really quick. And you're going to see in this video, Melo is actually going to be red hot on defense. Like, he's going to have the two rings lighting up under him. Now that's crazy because we all know the Mello, you know, he's not known for his defense, but when you're usering with him and you know how to make plays, you can literally get him to the point where he's red hot. As you saw, I got that mean block on D-Wade with Mello. And, um, you know, we're just going to make sure we double team and we play the perimeter. Now to double team guys, when they're coming up the court, I don't recommend double teaming every time unless you can see they really can't play. I'm, I recommend mixing it in. What we want to do is you want to tap the left bumper and you want to press the icon of the player um, on the wing nearest the guy with the ball or away from where the spot up shooters are. So say he's coming up on the right and most of his spot up shooters are on the right. Um, you might want to actually hit LB and then X to bring the small forward over who's going to be on the left and then that way you'll pretty much have the right side overloaded and if he has no one on the left side to pass to you'll pretty much have him locked up, you know, vice versa. Um, you know, just run it how you want. It takes a lot of practice. Most likely you're not going to lock up the first game you play with it, but it just takes a lot of practice and you can really lock people up. Now, keep in mind, this is the best alternative to man-to-man. -man. man to man defense is too sketchy for me. It's too easy to beat and, you know, it's the most widely used defense. So, therefore, I'm not going to run man unless I'm in special situations where I think I should. Um, just because, you know, anyone can pretty much beat man but it takes skill to actually beat an orthodox defense like a 3-2 trap. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this tip. This has been your boy Breeze. I'm signing out. Look for more great tips to come. I have a lot of great stuff coming out within the next couple weeks, so be on the lookout for that. Stay tuned. Make sure you hit that like button. If you enjoyed the video, comment, of course, subscribe. You don't want to miss what's to come, guys. A lot of great stuff coming out. So, be excited. This has been your boy Breeze. I'm signing out. Peace.